This needs to be the opening of the video. It's like some cool song. Oh my gosh, doesn't this look like my course? Course! I'm here with Brysa. <laughs> Glossier event pop up. <laughs> So we already left the Glossier event. I will show you guys tomorrow all of the cute like setup and stuff like that. But we're gonna go on this hike right now. Juices. Moon juice. Matcha green tea. <gasps> it's oh my matcha gosh! Green tea. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> You're always scaring me. I'm so it's excited. Matcha. <laughs> okay, we got changed. Look at our cute little <laughs> hiking outfits. We're starting this hike. I'll let you know when we hit a beautiful scenery. I think we're gonna catch sunset, so I'm super, super excited. I feel like I have my workout playlist now. Do you wanna share your workout playlist with my friends? <laughs> I can link sure. it. We I can, can. I'll link you her workout playlist below. I always love looking at what people listen to. <laughs> Where is the city? Right here? Oh yeah, it's right here. This? Oh, let me break your eyes over here. You see that right there? That is our beautiful city. And apparently we get reception up here, so that's a good thing too. <laughs> oh! <laughs> I lost you guys! <laughs> I think we're gonna go get tacos. Okay, level 1 to 10, how hard- how- <laughs> How Wham. hard? <laughs> Someone said that they hated the duck. <laughs> they hate the duck? I love the duck. I put the duck because when I'm talking in conversation, don't I? I'm like, meh. <laughs> and you that's do. the closest thing to it. So that's me usually like, meh. <laughs> but if you guys don't like it, I'll keep putting it anyways. <laughs> <laughs> anyways, from one to ten, how hard was this hike? It was like a, like, like a, a four. four. Yeah. I would say a like four, four or two. five max. The, there's observatory right here. Looks so tiny from there. What up guys? It is the Glossier pop-up day two. So I'm going back today, but this time I'm going with my friend Kelsey and which you guys have actually met. I'm gonna show you guys around this time because I totally did not even show you all the cute little setups that they had. Let's go swing in the house. Oh. It's like a full farmer's flizzle, flazzle. It's so perfect weather. Right? Yes, always. We are on our way to the Simon, Simon house. house. This is Kelsey, you guys know her. Carissa. Hi. Just got our Uber and yeah, we'll. How long, how far away is this, like 30 minutes? party last night and I did such an awful job I'm so sorry now I am on my way to another Glossier yet another Glossier event it's seriously like a Glossier week and this time it is a round table and it's I guess for youtubers or like creators like vloggers maybe I'm not exactly like 1000% sure on 
fuck, I missed it. I guess it's like a round table discussion with Emily and then Cassandra or Cassandra Gray. And she owns Violet Gray, which is like a really chic makeup boutique on Melrose Place. But I actually have not been, so this is going to be my first time checking it out. Uh, maybe you guys see YouTubers that you recognize. I know I'll recognize one face for sure. Asia, who you guys have met in a previous vlog. She's going to be there. She had texted me already. So, yeah, I'm excited to see her. That's what we're doing today. Wow, my teeth look really white, guys. Violet Gray and Glossier event. Finally meeting Joanna Spicer. You guys have to check out her channel. It's so funny. Um, and she, no, and she did. You did an amazing Glossier tutorial. I'm really complained about my life. <laughs> <laughs> and then we have Asia. I already told you guys that I was going to see a familiar Hello. face here. I have two drinks already, so I'm a little, you know, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> We're enjoying so much beauty time. I need to make a room like this in my house. No. A beauty room. Yeah. Guys, that was so why am I so blurry though? What an amazing conversation to be a part of. Um, I'm finally pulling into my neighborhood. I live about like 30 minutes without traffic from Violet Gray. So, um, oh my gosh, I have to pee so bad, you guys. Barely making it. You know when you're like so close and you're like, <gasps> fuck. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna park and I will catch you guys up later. This is a cute angle. Everybody's dream come true. This Childish Gambino song is fire. So, wait, actually, let me finish this song and then I'll talk to you guys. What is this store? Have you heard of it? Perla? It looks so cute. This is definitely new. I have not seen it and I'm always on this street. This store I love too, Curve. If I was like balling out of control, I would just shop there. That's like the only place you would need to go. So I am just driving down Robertson Boulevard right now. I'm here alone. Actually, I have a fitting today. I am working still on that kids bop tour. I'm like assisting. So I'm heading over to the spot called Ink and Thread, kind of customizing and decking out what we need for tour. I actually want to do an LA guide, maybe on the blog. If you guys want to see like a video. Oh my gosh, doesn't this look like my course? Just kidding, it doesn't. Oh my gosh, it totally was Michael Kors. Hilarious. <laughs> he looks like he grew a little beard. Um, I don't know if I pointed the camera right, but that was totally him. Oh yeah, what I was saying is I want to do like an LA guide. I can do it as a blog post and just kind of name all of my favorite places to shop, whether it be vintage or just regular stores or different areas. I kind of was trying to do that and I did little Tokyo travel type of guide. I can do that for different neighborhoods in LA. There's so many different neighborhoods. If you're from LA, you totally know what I'm talking about. There's just so many different cool areas and there's different types of shops for each, different cool places to eat. So if you guys would like to see that, comment and let me know that you would love to see that because I personally love LA. I get so offended when people are like, LA sucks and it doesn't. It's awesome, everybody's like, pretty chill. I mean, I totally, totally get when people say that LA kind of comes off as like a little bit superficial. I get it. Totally is. It totally, totally is. But there's like some cool neighborhoods and stuff. I'm on Melrose now. I can kind of show you guys around. 
I was on Melrose for the majority of those like Glossier pop-ups and stuff. Um, the, yeah, it was on Melrose Place. Violet Gray is on Melrose Place. We should do like a whole Melrose section because there's actually so many great places to shop on Melrose and I can kind of break that down for you guys. So whenever you come visit LA, you'll know where to go, like from a local. Isn't that so much better than like reading one of those guides? I've used guides before and then wherever I travel, I always ask people who actually live there what's cool, what's not. And then I'll look at the guides if I want to do like really touristy things. But like you guys know, like you can go see the Walk of Fame and that takes like two minutes because you don't want to hang out on Hollywood Boulevard. It's kind of lame, unless you go to El Capitan. I'm gonna do an LA guide, guys. I'm gonna do it, so stay tuned. There is that famous pink wall, guys. You will always find 10 million people a day. I'm not even exaggerating, I'm not. I don't get it. So now we're moving into the Fairfax district and they actually have a pretty cool flea market. On Sundays, I'll be uploading this vlog instead of the flea market, but I'll take you guys with me another time and also the Pasadena flea market. Um, it's really, really fun. I feel like I'm just chit-chatting and not really vlogging. I suck at vlogging. If you guys want to see vlogs, you don't. Oh, fuck. I was supposed to turn right there. I'm going to get to driving because this is totally illegal. Here with Rogs, we're about to go check out Kate Somerville. We're going to see what's going on at this event. I'm so excited. We get to meet Kate. Yes. <laughs> so excited. Lately. I was just telling um, Rox last night we like went and had pho after like the Kate event and I was just like I just feel like an explosion of happiness in my heart as of late I don't know what it is like I don't know I just feel really really good and I really really hope you guys are feeling good and happy Thank you again for sticking to the end and I will see you next time bye guys <laughs>